Calgary family is grateful to spend this Christmas together after nearly losing one member nine months ago. Doctors told eight-year-old Ethan Nielsen's family he may never wake up after he was hit by a truck. But the boy has made amazing progress. Alicia Fieldberg has more. <laughs> a game of Twister means much more than it used to for the Nielsen family. They never thought they'd all be home for the holidays this year. Eight-year-old Ethan was hit by a truck in Cranston March 17th while walking home with his sister from piano lessons. A helicopter flew him to hospital with serious brain injuries where he lie in a coma for more than two weeks. They told us it didn't look good, that uh, his chances of making it were not good. <laughs> there you go. Right. Good job, buddy. Six weeks after the accident, he was starting to move, communicating with smiles and high fives from his hospital room. Oh, left foot in the air. <laughs> now nine years old and in grade four, Ethan is back home, back in school. Jump, Ethan. Gaining mobility and speech each day. <laughs> Good job, bud. We didn't think he'd ever walk again, let alone talk and things like that and here he is he's still doing well academically he's back with his friends he's doing wall climbing Ethan's neighborhood is evolving too new to the intersection where he got hit a crosswalk stop sign and school zone better now that we have marked crosswalks but by no means fixed the Nielsen's want safety features to come sooner before a new school opens not months later more than 10 new schools popped up in the area in the past few years. The ward councillor says though school boards share the responsibility, the city needs to take the lead. Changing bylaws or just taking the initiative and get it done and then worry about who, uh, who has to pay the bill later, because we're talking safety. All right, Ethan. Though everyday challenges remain, the family cherishes each moment. And the signs, Ethan is still the same kid, once again the top student in math, who shares a special bond with his sister and makes his family laugh. All make this Christmas extra special. Just this time of year you have a lot, to, a lot of time where you reflect and you think about all the things you have to be grateful for and um, we are so grateful for um, not only that we have him with us but for how far he's come. Alicia Fieldberg, CTV News, Calgary. And the Nielsen's would also like to see larger no parking zones around intersections to create better visibility for both drivers and pedestrians.